Hello everyone. Now in this lecture we will learn how to plot different curves in MATLAB. The plots which will be covered in this lecture will be step plot curve, root locus curve, Bode plot and Nyquist plot. So now this is our transfer function gs equal to s plus 3 upon s cube plus s square plus 3s plus 1. First of all, we will find the step load, step load curve for this transfer function. So, writing the numerator now in square bracket, this is 1 and 3, 1, 3, semicolon enter, then square bracket. 1 1 3 1 1 1 3 1 semicolon enter sys equal to tf num 10 so this is our transfer function s plus 3 divided by s u plus s square plus 3 s plus 1 which is the same as the one we have taken in the example so first we will get the step load curve for this we write the command step bracket sys enter Second one will be the root of the plot. Then after that, we will try to get the body plot and then the Nyquist, Nyquist plot. So here is our step load curve. As you can see, this is the step load curve. On the x-axis, we have the time in second, and on the y-axis, we have the amplitude now we get the root locus plot for this the command is r locus and the, in bracket we write the name of the transfer function which here is sys enter this is the root locus plot for the system if we double click anywhere we can get the gain pole damping overshoot percentage and frequency of that point of the system in the root locus plot like this here if we click we get the details here also now we plot the body plot for this the command is body and then says enter this is our body plot for getting the stability margins like gain margin and phase margin we go into the characteristics after right clicking on our mouse select all stability margins and here we get the stability margins here if we click here we can get the gain margin and the frequency and it also shows that the system is not stable in the closed loop here we get the phase margin similarly for the our last example for the Nyquist plot, we write the command as Nyquist sys enter, and here it is. We get the Nyquist plot of the system. Similarly, right clicking and going to the characteristics and selecting all the stability margins, we get the phase margin delay margin and the 
frequency also and this also shows that the system is not stable in the closed loop so thank you for watching this video please like share and subscribe and give me suggestions for the next video thank you